This is an example of how to write a problem definition using our cause mapping method, starting very basic and then adding detail as it becomes available. I'm going to use the challenger disaster in this case study. Our cause mapping method has three basic steps. Problem definition, where you identify specifics and consequences of the issue, the analysis, where you lay out cause and effect, and the chronology, and then solutions, where you identify action items to prevent recurrence. I'm going to focus in this case study on how to define a problem. This is a summary of the Challenger disaster. I'll use this information to write the problem definition. You can pause the video to read through this. The problem definition has four basic questions. What is the problem? When did it happen? Where did it happen? And how is each goal affected along with the frequency? So in the Challenger disaster, the problem was obviously that the Challenger exploded, but there's also a loss of life. They can both be written down. There's the date and the time, and there's the location where this incident occurred. In terms of the impact to safety, there's a loss of life, there's a loss of the entire orbiter, and then there's the impact to the mission, the customer payload, and the entire investigation. And this was the first time that a shuttle had been lost. So even with limited information, these four basic questions allow you to define a problem. Anything that's unknown or missing, just label as a question mark, and it can be added later. The problem definition can be expanded as needed. You can capture that it was abnormally cold that morning, some specifics about the Kennedy Space Center, the launch complex, some detail about the mission, and as the information becomes available, the overall impact to the goals. So this is a more detailed problem outline, but there is no issue starting very basic and then expanding as the information becomes available. If you'd like to test this approach for the problem definition and then build a 5Y cause map for the Challenger incident, there's a link to an exercise in the problem description. You can try this on your own, or you can evaluate it with your group. I hope you find some of this information helpful in your problems. Thanks for watching, and have a good day.